Hi guys, so we had a few questions as to what to do with your leftover kale and I'm quickly going to show you one of my favorite breakfast recipes with leftover kale. So we've got some kale here. You can see it's still uh, nice and glossy from all the oil. And um, just a quick recap, we added about a quarter of a cup olive oil, extra virgin olive oil, uh, about two tablespoons apple cider vinegar and then a little bit of salt, a little bit of mustard, whole grain mustard works best, and then always a bit of sweetness. I love using honey, but you can use coconut sugar, agave, stevia if you want. But for this recipe, using honey is definitely the best route to go, and I'll show you why in two seconds. So I've got this pan on high heat. I just put it on the highest setting and on the, the biggest option. And um, I'm gonna take the kale. You'll see some of the juices are still there. I'm gonna add it into my pan. And I'd say about two cups is quite nice because it's going to fry. So you'll actually get about one and a little bit more cup as an end result. So for one person, this is great. But even for two people, it's perfect. Cool. So that's in. I'll even add the dressing and we'll just let that cook for quite a while. So this is a quick tip. If you're serving a breakfast with great, I've got a baguette here. Just pop it into your pan while the juices are still in there because you want it to catch the slight oil or caramelization. You just look at that. It's already toasted and just a few seconds and it's got a beautiful deep caramelization.